some days ago i released uh, ios 15 e ios 15 rom for uh, the samsung galaxy s5 and you as well saw the new beautiful launcher by luton hit a launcher that deserves a rom so today i decided because there is in fact nothing new um, Eugene is having holidays and Stricted will release around the 15th and uh, yeah Harit as well will I think next week or so release a new build of the Sakura ROM but for now nothing to play with so I thought you know you know what let me create a beautiful uh, a beautiful iOS 15 e iOS 15 ROM based on e foundation uh, firmware because it's just the best for iOS uh, styled ROMs. Um, it's a beautiful, beautiful, good working ROM peeps, really. I've been testing it since yesterday. I wanted to upload uh, this video yesterday, but uh, in fact, I wanted to upload the ROMs yesterday, but I was a little bit busy, you know. Uh, so, welcome again to channel 48. Thank you for tuning in. My name is Puck, and let's take a look at these two beautiful e iOS. 15 Android ROMs for the Galaxy S8 Dream LTE and the Dream 2 LTE. Uh, the exact models will be in the description. start for the first time I want you to go for the bliss launcher and then hit always okay now why well because the iOS launcher is not prepared yet to run we're gonna go to settings beautiful settings and we're gonna go to the internet and first connect to the internet let's do that first okay we're connecting and we are connected to the internet next thing to do is to go to the second icon at the top that is saying aurora store this one here next next let's put it let's accept let's put it pitch black 
Okay, next, make that yellow and go in as anonymous. You can ignore the update of the store for now, but I want you to select here at the bottom updates. In the update section, you're gonna see um, some applications that need to be updated, such as the launcher iOS 15. You must update it because it's not working out of the box. So if you would start with the iOS 15 launcher and you would set it to always, you would get into a boot loop and then only advanced uh, users know how to you know, stop that. So always go for the Bliss launcher first, okay? very very important so you don't get into problems so we take a look um, the launcher is updated the ios launcher we update magic earth we update iptv iptv must be updated otherwise it won't even boot it won't start okay and we install the google services you don't have to uh you don't have to update because that is micro G. No need to update that. Okay, so now we are fully updated. So only thing that we do now is hit the iOS 15 launcher. We pull down, turn off the internet for now a bit. Okay. Because now we're going to set up the system and you don't want to have internet with that. You don't want the banner in your face because if you're going to go here uh, in, the, in this part of the launcher, by the way, very nice of Luton to, to make it this way, you know, a banner will play. So, in fact, it's not nice that I'm turning off the internet now. But, um, yeah, I need to fix some things and that's why I'm doing that for now. Okay, but you can as well leave the internet on and look at the banner and let it play. In that way, you are as well supporting him. You know, in no way he will push a banner or a advertisement just like in Apple devices, a full screen advertisement before, you know, that while you're using the app. Nothing like that. So he's he's a very nice guy. Okay. You can as well, if you like this look and feels and, and you don't have this phone that I'm showing, you can as well go to the Play Store and look for iOS 15 launcher by Loot and Hit. Install it. Buy it. Okay. Do me a favor. Get it. It's just a beautiful launcher. And whenever I create, you know, some something like this, then you can as well use your own bot launcher in it. Okay. So um, let me see. The things that we need to do are the layout. I'm going to set that to six and make this a little bit bigger. It's a big screen, you know. You see, it's going to get a little bit bigger like this. And then we're going to boot it up again. Okay, default launcher, home up, and we set it to default. Okay, as you can see, it's not crashing anymore. Get out, cancel, go away. You are already default launcher. So here, we need to as well fix uh, the icons, but I showed you that already. Okay, but you have the power to do that all. But I just want to show you a nice uh, way of setting up your system so it looks good. I don't want you to have a system running a ROM that I put together that looks bad. So make sure to give the right icons here. To the Aurora store, you give it the App Store icon. The browser, you give it the Chrome browser, or you can give it the Google uh, uh, G browser, whatever you wish. Um, the files, we have a special icon for that, the iOS launcher. You can give it the home icon. You see that? IPTV, you're going to give it Apple TV icon. The thing was look good. The Magic uh, Earth, you're going to give the official maps icon. Here you have email. You see that? And this one is very important to change. And that is the messaging icon as well. The red new icon, or at least the, the iOS 7 icon is back. And uh, in fact, that's it, uh, peeps. Oh yeah, this this one you can give the Safari icon, so it looks nice with the system. You know, and this one I cannot reach it. I don't know why. Oh, I reached it. And this one we give the iPod icon. That's the retro port. 
and um, yeah, in the app library, you as well want some things. So I would say just put two uh, or three. in the same folder you know just here three in game that is enough then we go to the other that one we're just gonna put in audio you know like that and uh etc etc go fill it up you know and, and and get a nice little uh, app library here fill them up look at the sections and go Go fill them up. Uh, we as well have amazingly beautiful wallpapers. Yeah, we have dark mode. But of course, dark mode, dark. We even have pitch black. And um, wallpapers. There are several official, uh, at least official e-foundation wallpapers. And I think some uh, iOS wallpapers. I would go for the e wallpapers. There are such beautiful wallpapers. Look at this one. Very lovely. And if it's hurting your eyes, that sun. Just oh yeah, I should not forget to tell you about uh, the the control uh, uh, panel. This one here. It's powered by me. And then you're gonna have this, you just hit OK. You see that? And now you have an amazingly beautiful control center. Those that saw my videos know about this because it's always there. At the left, you get the notifications. At the right, you get your control center with your toggles, Wi-Fi on, etc., Bluetooth, mobile data. If you're not using it, just turn it off. So it won't use no extra battery. Set up your system and you're good to go, peeps. And of course, we cannot forget about your widgets. Long press on the home screen. You're gonna see a little plus at the top, hit it. And then you can get your, for instance, weather uh, on the desktop. Okay, uh, you will need to grant permission uh, for that. Uh, so granted permission let me show you it all works good okay um, location where was that again here location we're gonna turn it on you can turn on your battery saving mode but remember if you're gonna uh, navigate if you're gonna uh, open your navi you as well have a navi built in uh, powered by magic earth um, then you must not put on the battery saving in um, in your location otherwise it will not find the GPS okay so make sure that you don't put your location on battery saving mode it must be on high accuracy okay very important otherwise the maps won't work because you have an amazing navigation application built in as well okay and you really want to use it you know, you really want to use it because it's a pity not to use it. You can give permission. Location is on. And uh, as well, turn off the battery saving mode. And then it should find the GPS anytime from now. There you go. You see that? GPS is found. So you can navigate. But you must download your map eh, from your country. Up here, we already granted. This will take a little. It's already arrived. And boom, there you have a beautiful uh, weather uh, widget. Long press. Get another widget on your desktop. For instance, this one here. Oh, there is no more space. Maybe here, somewhere here. Boom. Create. You see that? 
We have picture, a picture widget as well. Let's get that one. I hope there are no embarrassing pictures. Better I don't do that. Okay, so uh, this is it, my friends. Uh, I don't have to make this video uh, any longer, right? You already saw it. This is what you can play with this weekend. Uh, make sure to uh, discover uh, the App Store from E as well. Check out the open source applications that are fully available in this App Store. Okay, check it out. As well, uh, play some music. Let me know if the sound is okay. Um, sound should be good. Okay, I've been playing music yesterday with this device and it sounded pretty good. Only I have one channel output, but I have it since I got this phone. So I don't know what it is. Well, in fact, the S8. This is the S8 Plus, so not this phone. I'm talking about the S8. Never tested this one, by the way, yet over my amplifier. I hope that this one plays over two channels. I don't know what it is, why it only plays over one channel. So yeah, and of course the app library, you can go fill it up. So this is it. Uh, yeah, I say back to the studio long enough. That was it. Thank you for watching. Have a fantastic weekend. Subscribe to the channel if you did not already. And then I will see you or you will be seeing me in the next video again. Until then, bye-bye.